Hi guys, welcome to the video. Please remember that if you enjoyed this video, why not subscribe? And while you're at it, hit that bell icon, and then you'll get updated every single time I upload a video. Welcome back to another coin roll hunting video. As you can see from the title and from what I've got in front of me, I once again have sealed bags of 50 pence coins. I've already had a quick brief look at these and none of these actually contain a full bag of the same variant. So I'm just going to get straight into them. Because if you do ever come across a full sealed bag with the same variant in it, it's up to you what you do with it. I mean, for me, if it was a new design, I'd probably keep it sealed until we had the mintage figures released on that design. Because you never know, that could be a low mintage coin when those, uh, like, variants get released, the information on those variants get released. So, as usual, I'm looking for, with the Britannia, which is this design here, I'm looking for 2008 dated coins. As we can see here, this is a 1997. So with all Britannias, they go to one side and I check them off camera later. And then with the shield design, which, oh hang on, I've got a variant, so let me come back to that. There we go, that's our first variant today. That there is the Scouts 50 pence coin. So let me put these up a bit and move that there. So as I was saying, with the shield designs, I'm looking for 2009, 2010, 2011, and 2016, because those are not intended for circulation years, or NIFCs. And this entire bag so far has been one variant Oh, another variant, but yeah, I didn't find a single shield in that bag. That's absolutely crazy. But let's have a look here. We found our second design here, our second variant. There we go. That is the Christopher Ironside 50 pence coin. So there we go. A whole bag, a whole sealed bag, all Britannias except for two variants, not a single shield. So I've told you the NIFC years that I'm looking for on the shield. And for any of you joining me for the first time today, I will try and show you a shield coin in a second. So there we go. We've got our first shield. So with these, I put them to one side straight away because there's usually not many of them. And I check the dates on those on camera for those non-circulating years. The reason that they end up in circulation sometimes is because people can take them out from annual coin sets and spend them and then people like me hopefully can come along and find them. They're worth more than 50 pence. The They vary between 40 pounds and maybe 70 pounds depending which year you've got. 2010 is the one worth the least. And like I said, anything really north of 60 pounds for the other three variants then. There we go. So we're going to go, oh, I'll just check the shield dates on these now. So 2004, 2014, and 2015. So no good there. So let's have a look at the third bag. Uh, a lot of people are still asking me how I actually get these bags. I mean, I get them from the post office just up the road, but all you have to do is walk into your own bank as long as you bank with them, they'll give you change. You take in 50 pounds, ask them for 50 pence coins or two pound coins, and they should have no problem with giving you those. There we go, two shields there. And yeah, but if you've got a local post office or something and you're, you know, quite a friendly person or you get on with the people that run the post office, they quite often don't have a problem themselves with just letting you have change because with the bigger post offices you actually have to have like a business account in order to get change from the post office so many britannias we've got already it's crazy and therefore now looking at the dates on these so 2015 and 2014 so we've only had five shields from three sealed bags this is crazy so there's going to be a lot of Britannias to check through. So I'm hoping that in the middle of those Britannias somewhere, at least, is a 2008. At least one 2008. I've been quite lucky with finding some of those recently. There we go. It's a Britannia. 
Britannia and a shield. So there's two more shields. A Britannia and oh, looks like we have a variant. Doesn't look in good condition though. That there is the Commonwealth Games 50 pence coin and does not look good at all. There we go, still. It's a variant nonetheless. nonetheless. So Britannia, Britannia. What's this? Again, we got here. This one's a little bit damaged, just a shield, but shield, Britannia, Britannia, sorry. Britannia, Britannia, and a shield, and a Britannia, and a Britannia, and a Britannia, and a Britannia. So bring the shields into play. Let's have a look at these dates. So we got a 2012, 2012, 2015, 2014, and then the clips 2015. So on to the last bag. There we go, just get rid of that. And not been really that fortunate so far. We've just got the three variants. So the Scouts, the Ironside, and a Commonwealth Games. So we've got a Britannia, a Britannia, and a Britannia, and a Shield. There we go. Another Britannia, Shield, Britannia, Shield. Two Britannias. Put those down there. And a Britannia, Shield. So yeah, still looking for those 2017 Beatrix Potter coins. Only got one of those at the moment. Oh, there it is again. Just open my mouth. I'll just do the last two at the back and then we'll get on to it. Because inevitably, it's been a few weeks, I think. But here we go. It's another variant today. It's our last variant today. But Mrs. Tiggy Winkle. People really don't like these coins, do they? I mean... It's quite hard to find any of the other Beatrix Potter coins anymore, the 2016 ones, but I reckon a lot of people just see that and they're just like, I don't like that. It's going back in. Someone else can have it. There we go. 2012, 2012, 2014, and is that? Oh, I thought it was a 2016 there, but it's not. It's 2015. So, still no luck on my NIFC hunt whilst I've been doing these videos. Uh, I'll have a look off camera in a second at the Britannias and I'll let you know if I found any 2008 to add to the ones that I've already found and we'll have a look at what I've got today. So here is my coin haul from today. Now I've been through all of the Britannias and I'm quite shocked that I didn't find one single 2008 dated version. Uh, especially considering from five sealed bags Predominantly today, I had nothing but the Britannia coins. I maybe had about 10 to 15 of the shields, four variants. And it just goes to show that that 2008 coin is quite hard to find. and Such a low mintage. But yeah, let me know in the comment section if you've been finding any of those recently. But today I got a Scouts 50 pence coin. The Christopher Ironside 50 pence coin. The Commonwealth Games 50 pence coin and a Mrs. Tiggy Winkle coin, which I jinxed myself because I found it just as I was talking about the 2017 Beatrix Potter coins I hadn't yet found. And then Tiggy Winkle from 2016 crept into that bag. But anyway, let me know in the comments section below what have you found recently, either through coin roll hunting or maybe you've had something really cool in your change. But leave that below, I like to read about all this. Please like this video if you enjoyed it, and please subscribe for future content on coins. Thanks for watching!